Shadow was able to escape us, and he had also kidnapped Kanda, Jojo's mother. We scoured the entire ocean, tracking them down. We made a vow that we would all risk our lives and set her free from those villains. By the time we found the ship, it was engulfed in flames. For a moment, we thought we had failed, but it turned out that Kanda was able to get away on her own. She was safe. With this woman's magic, we would finally be able to stop the threat that was looming over us all. And then the zombies attacked Tortuga. Nothing we did could stop them, Mama. And there were so many of them. There were enough to fill about 30 ships. But how is this possible for there to be that many? Huh? You see, the magic that raises the bodies of the dead is very difficult, and not many understand it. It requires an energy so great that it can only summon a few zombies at a time. And the magic is so dark that the person who uses it is often unable to control it. So the monsters will turn against their master, and balance will return to the natural order of things. Everything goes back to normal. But there are so many zombies, and the magic controlling them hasn't run out. We're facing something I've never seen before. A magic that could threaten the entire world. I might have an explanation. Lord Blade is also a zombo, or whatever you call them. Only he's not as rotten, and he controls all the others. What he's trying to say is that Blade is a different kind of zombie from the others. He could be the sorcerer who's behind everything. Maybe these ancient spells are just more powerful than those in Africa. No mortal has such great power. But an immortal, an ancient spirit as old as the weather. Madam, this is getting too difficult for me. I don't understand. I'll explain later. For now, we must look for the source of the spirit. Hmm. <sighs> There. We need to sail in that direction. Ah, long as you're not taking us toward those black sails. That's fine with me. Shadow, there's a suspicious ship with black sails approaching. Let him approach, then. I've been waiting for him. Very well, then. But I can't wait until this whole nightmare is over. Hello! Over here! I'm Lord Blade, we're governor of Jamaica. I'm looking for a man named Shadow. Is he with you? So he says he's a royal British governor. All right, I'll take my chances. Yes, my lord! He's here! You can come on over! Huh. Do not let them see you until I say so. So tell me, where are you heading off to with those black sails? To somebody's funeral? Yes. To your funeral! But I hit him! Why didn't he go down? Because, you fool, he's already dead! Enough of that noise! I have serious work to do! Accept your fate. It will come for us all sooner. Huracan told me that you let the sorceress get away. Is that true? Yes. Her magic is as powerful as they say. She used it to sow chaos amongst the crew. 
and make her escape. That won't happen with me and the zombies. We have to stop her. Huracan, we need you. Continue to pursue your little scheme, even though I made it clear that you are to follow my orders. Your stubbornness continues to delay your mission. So now, you'll give up this foolish chase and resume your duties as my servant. Ugh. No, huh? what I mean is, we can't let the sorceress get away. Because she's too dangerous, and you know I'm right. I wanted to use her against you, that's true. I admit it. But if we hadn't tried to capture her, we would have never known that Silver and his crew were also after her. We know she's the mother of one of those children. And without doubt, she'll help them fight you. In fact, she might even find a way to disrupt the whole plan. Yes, that woman truly has that much power. Find that ship and bring everyone in that crew back to me. I want all of them returned alive. No, Silver is mine. I must finish him. You will but only when I say so. Ah. To your positions! Hoist the sails! They will not escape us! If there's no wind, how are we supposed to move through these dead waters? Forest! Ah! Flint forest! Ah! Flint might like it. But this wall of trees is choking me. I miss the horizon. And my bad leg is itching. That's a <gasps> Let's just pray for good weather. The rain here is just a nasty shower of warm water. Huh? Get down! Arrows! It seems so small, but I bet it's soaked in the venom of a poisonous frog. Just one sting and no man would last for long. We have to find a way to tell them that we come in peace. Tell them! You can't reason with them. Prepare the muskets and the cannons. Show them how real fighting is done. No! We're not invading or attacking. We will not hurt these people. It's the wind. Maybe we have another way. Prepare the maneuvers. Good. They won't surprise us with those poison darts. We're losing them, and so the Albatross, the best ship in the Caribbean, will fly away on a puff of wind. Um, I don't think that puff of wind wants to help us fly away. Then break out the weapons! Load the pistols and the muskets! Huh? We'll fight like demons before we let them do us in! First Mate Silver, I gave you orders not to shoot, and you huh? will disobey me? I'll shoot Captain Hawkins, and if you don't want me to do it, then you'll have to shoot me yourself, because I, at this point, have mutinied. Mm. All aboard! All aboard! Ah! Huh? Look over there. Flint is saying that someone is coming to help us. How do you know they want to help us? I sense that they come in peace. Huh? Hmm. Simuna Hanawana Hemi. What? What? Flint? Flint? Pirate? Flint speaks a language you don't understand, which made these people think that he was a magic omen. They followed him, then found us. You feathery old rascal. You've just earned double ration of biscuits. Ah, oh, biscuits! Mako Ojibwe. Ojibwe. Ebihuna sete Ojibwe. Makate funanola. Unka sa balasham, bataisam, potato. Long John, it looks like they were waiting for you. They worship you as a leader. Now you're their king. Dice, 
He say no. Or no man jaka. Anaka Manoa. What's that? Say that again? Anaka Manoa. Iminoa. Ah, Manoa. Ah. Yes. Long John, what's with you? <laughs> Don't you know what this means? Manoa, the mystical lost city in the forests of the Americas. The same one that the Spaniards called El Dorado. Ben Gunn, when he was alive, had heard all the legends. Manoa, the city where the roads are paved with gold, where they have gems on every corner. Forget about Lord Blade. Down the train with that lousy shadow and the thought of those rotting hordes of zombies. Tonight, I'm gonna swim in a sea of gold. Drop anchor for your ship and come aboard the Maldita. It's time for us to go hunting, deep in the heart of darkness. Ishiwo. No need for that. Do you understand that it's best not to engage us in battle? Well done! But now I need your help. You. Come here. Do I have to send someone to get you? If you answer my questions, this will all go smoothly. Some others came here before we did, understand? On another big boat. A big boat. Where'd they go? Oh. Hmm. Yes, I know they have gone down the river, but this river branches off into many forks. I have to know which of those forks to follow, understand? Get going. We'll find our own way. We're moving on. Hmm. But not yet. Hmm. You get to stay and be our guide. Oh. 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 With Manoa waiting for me. I don't even care about the bugs or the heat anymore. I'm beginning to like this place. Huh? Look over there. There's a huge giant lake. I see it. And that must be Manoa. I don't see anything that's shimmering. Maybe there is no gold on the houses. Not much can shimmer when the air's this heavy. Is it too early for me to retire? Thank you, thank you. <laughs> this is all very nice, but show me where you keep the gold. You know, gold. Let them enjoy their new king. It's not like the gold's going to run away. Ah, I bet those are the baskets full of gems. <laughs> What's this? What's with the fruit? Mm. Mm. Don't be so upset. This tastes much better than a jewel. Mm? No, we can eat afterward. Do you understand me? Please just take us to the treasure. The treasure. Mm. Mm. Ojimiboto, Kusamata. Ah, oh, now we're talking. This is real gold. Hmm. Look at you, Long John. I'd say those feathers make you look exactly <laughs> like Flint. 
That's enough of that. We'll celebrate later. Now I want to see the rest of the gold. The gold. Understand? The gold. Also, Mattia. Hmm? Oh, why didn't you say so? Yes, yes, I knew it, I knew it! Gold! Ah, gold! Yes, thank you, Great Neptune, thank you! Effective for <laughs> keeping out the bad guys. Well done. Excellent job. You've kept my gold very safe. <laughs> but now I want to lay eyes on the treasure behind this door. It's all true. The door really is made of gold. Uh -huh. But how does it open? Oh, even you don't know how? Well then, we're all pretty smart. We'll find a way to do it, right? Long John, uh... I'm really sorry, but we'll never get this to open because this isn't even a door. It's just a simple stone wall painted like a golden door, see? It comes right off. There is no treasure here. It's just a trap and that's it. So that's why they made up all those legends. It was a trick to defend themselves against the greedy conquistadors. Huh? There. This is where I need you. Where do we go now? Which of these two forks of the river do we take? Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh. Draw a map, now! Mm. Mm. It appears that both forks will lead to the same place, to what I suppose is a giant lake. So either direction will lead us to that lake. Well, then we'll take the shortest path. Oh. 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 <laughs> yes, I know. These ships weren't meant to sail in the forest, but those who do not try do not win. Bow to port! Yes, I can do anything. Anything! You will not escape me this time, Silver! Yes, yes, later. Thank you. Right now, I'm not hungry. When hungry? Uh, hungry? We may not have gold, but at least our bellies are full. I really like Manoa. I could even live here with Tracy. Huh? Where is Tracy? She went with Mama Kenda. She wanted to help her prepare to search for the spirit. Ma, you have such beautiful hair. You really think so? And why did you choose me to go with you? Because it takes a woman to inhale the smoke and enter the vision, and another to stay and look after her, to make sure she's not disturbed by demons. But I, I'm still only a young girl. No, Jojo has told me everything. You're a woman. A woman who has carried a tremendous weight on her shoulders ever since her father passed away. If I had had a daughter along with Jojo, I would have wanted her to be just as strong as you. The time has now come. Are you ready? Go and wake up Jim. But 
What do I do? You'll come with me to meet the spirit. Up there? But why should I go? Because you are a medicine man. It's something that I saw very clearly in my vision. I... I want to be a doctor, but not until I'm older. I still have to study and... Anyone can study to become a doctor, but only a few are born with a real gift for human medicine. And your fate huh? will be difficult. You are being called to treat an enormous wound, one that infects the world. Oh. It's here. Oh, oh. You do not need your eyes. You will not be able to see it. You can only hear it. Listen. Oh, great spirit. You must know that we have come in peace, and this young medicine man has traveled many great distances to meet you. Do not take him, please. He just wants to understand your reason for releasing such a great horror. Please help him understand it. Yes, that's good. Your instinct is powerful and guides you well. Listen to what you're feeling, Jim. What do you feel? I... I feel... I feel... I feel your pain! That wretched scoundrel Blade. Great Neptune, he's found us! We have to get to the Albatross and prepare the firearms! No! We can't let Minogue get caught in the middle of this. That's what he would want. We have to escape. That way we can draw their fire away from these people. Yes, it's time for us to leave. Find their ship, destroy it, and then we will turn this forest into their grave. Huh. How dare you, human dog! I'm chasing the fugitives, just as we agreed! We're one step away from catching them, so what is your problem now? You will not hurt my people. But the ship is anchored right in front of that village, and I have to sink it, or Silver will get away! If huh. you harm just hmm? one of my people, I'll destroy you. <sighs> just tell me what it is you want me to do. Let them get away? Do what you have to do in order to catch them. Take your men and follow the river. There. They're heading straight for the river. And they're still fast as ever. All hands to the sails and the oars. They've covered more water. Great Neptune. Without wind, we'll be stuck here, and they'll gain on us! Are you able to find the source, Mama? We found the spirit and met with it. Now please listen to me, my son. Love of my life, if great pain ever falls upon you, even if it feels as heavy as a mountain, swear to me that you will never surrender to hatred. Swear to me! Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Great Neptune! The river current is running too fast, and now we're being pulled to the rapids! I just hope that later, there won't be a... There is a waterfall! Hurry! Drop anchor! All hands on deck! Need to show our momentum, whatever it takes! Hold on to the deck! Don't let go for anything in the world!